In this video, we will learn about even and odd numbers. Every number in math is either an even number or an odd number. Let's begin with even numbers. Even numbers are the numbers that can be split into pairs, that is groups of two. For example, number 4. We have 4 kids here. If I split them into groups of 2, there is none who is alone. So, 4 is an even number. Now, let's talk about odd numbers. Odd numbers are the numbers that cannot be paired equally. There is always someone which is left alone. For example, number 3. We have 3 kids here. If I split them into groups of two, there is this one kid who is left alone. So, three is an odd number. Even numbers are the numbers that can be split into pairs, that is groups of two. Odd numbers cannot be paired equally and one is always left alone. Now, let us look at each number from 1 to 10 and identify even and odd numbers. Let's begin with 1. This kid here is alone with no friends. So, 1 is an odd number. Another kid joins him. Now, we have two kids. Here, they have formed a group of two with no one left alone. So, 2 is an even number. Let's look at next number that is 3. Here we have 3 tigers. Let us split them into groups of 2. Again, this tiger is left alone. So, 3 is an odd number. Let us look at number 4. We have 4 balls. We will create groups of 2. Nothing left. So, 4 is an even number. Number 5. We have 5 dogs here. Group them into 2's. 1 left alone. So 5 is an odd number. Number 6. That is we have 6 flowers. Again group them into 2's. Nothing left. So 6 is an even number. Number 7. We have 7 oranges here. Again group them into 2's. 1 is left alone. So 7 is an odd number. Number 8. 8 butterflies. Groups of 2. Nothing left. So 8 is an even number. Number 9. 9 birds. Groups of 2. 1 left. So 9 is an odd number. Number 10. 10 dots. Groups of 2, nothing left. So 10 is an even number. So 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9 are all odd numbers. Because when we split them into groups of 2, 1 is always left alone. 2, 4, 6, 8 and 10 are all even numbers. Because they all can be split into exact groups of two. We have seen how we identify if a number is odd or even for numbers 1 to 10. Now let us see for the numbers that are greater than 10. For numbers greater than 10, to find if it's even or odd, look at the end. Example 36. This is the number at the end. 6 is an even number. So, 36 is an even number. Let us look at some more examples. Here, 3 is a number at the end. 3 is an odd number. So, 23 is an odd number. 8 is an even number. So, 98 is an even number. 9 is an odd number. So, 79 is an odd number. 5 is an odd number. So 45 is an odd number. Now look at these numbers 50 and 20. 
they are both tens numbers since 10 is an even number 50 and 20 are also even so if a number ends with 0 2 4 6 and 8 they are all even numbers if a number ends with 1 3 5 7 and 9 it is an odd number So let us now summarize. If you are an even number, you always have a pair. So if you look around, your friend will always be there. So 2, 4, 6, 8 and 10 are all even numbers. But if you are an odd number, there is always a lonely one. He looks around to find his friend but he is the only one. So 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9 are all odd numbers. If you have any additional queries or suggestions, please do leave us a comment below. Do not forget to check the description below for additional information and worksheets.